Daniel Joseph Dan Daly was born on November 11, 1873, in Glen Cove, Long Island, New York. He enlisted in the Marine Corps on January 10, 1899, and embarked on a path destined for greatness. Known as Devil Dog Dan Daly, he stood at just 5 feet, 6 inches and weighing a mere 132 pounds, but his physical stature belied his immense strength and courage. From serving on various vessels and engaging in combat across different regions, his valor earned him the Medal of Honor during the Boxer Rebellion in China. Years later, Daly faced another extraordinary challenge in Haiti. Leading his men through a treacherous river and enduring a night of enemy fire, he guided them to safety and led a successful charge against the enemy. This remarkable feat earned him a second Medal of Honor. During World War I's Battle of Below Wood, Daly fearlessly confronted a machine gun armed only with a pistol and hand grenades. His audacious actions neutralized the threat and inspired his fellow Marines with his iconic battle cry, Come on, you sons of bitches, do you want to live forever? Major General John A. Lejeune, former Commandant of the Marine Corps, hailed Daly as the outstanding Marine of all time, while Major General Smedley D. Butler declared him the fightingest Marine I ever knew. Such accolades were bestowed upon Daly by both officers and enlisted men, a testament to his extraordinary character. Despite the recognition, Daly remained humble, shunning the spotlight and considering medals as mere trinkets. Instead, he focused on the welfare of his fellow Marines and declined numerous offers of a commission, opting to remain an exceptional sergeant. Sergeant Major Daniel Joseph Daly's incredible legacy culminated with his retirement from the Marine Corps on February 6, 1929. His remarkable list of accolades speaks volumes about his heroism and valor. Alongside his two medals of honor, Daly was adorned with the Navy Cross, the Silver Star, and a host of foreign decorations, including the Médaille Militaire and the Croix de Guerre with Palm. Beyond the battlefield, Daly's personal life reflected his dedication to the Marine Corps. Remaining unmarried, he famously stated that he could not envision a more fulfilling life than that of a Marine. Sergeant Major Daniel Joseph Daly passed away on April 28, 1937, in Glendale, Long Island, New York. His invincible spirit and bravery continue to inspire Marines, and his name forever symbolizes courage, selflessness, and the true spirit of a warrior.